morning children hope you all are doing well today we are going to start our new chapter chapter 14 diameter and area today we are going to study what is perimeter perimeter of a square perimeter of a rectangle perimeter of a triangle and their formulas to calculate okay so all of you open page number 104 chapter 14 perimeter and area okay now let's start what is perimeter so children length of any closed boundary figure is known as perimeter okay now for finding the perimeter of a square perimeter of triangle and perimeter of rectangle we are having three different formulas so first of all we will start with perimeter of square perimeter of square okay is equal to 4 into length of one side okay clear to all of you perimeter of square is equal to 4 into length of one side this is your square and in square all four sides are equal clear to all of you so that that's why we are multiplying four the one two three four four into length of one side okay so this is the formula to find perimeter of a square now let's see perimeter of rectangle perimeter of rectangle is equal to 2 into length plus breadth i hope still to all of you perimeter of rectangle is equal to 2 into length plus breadth because Okay, so children, 
Let's start with the exercise 14A. After solving the questions of 14A, your concept of finding the direct measure of square, rectangle and triangle will, more, will be more clear. Okay? So children, let's start with the exercise 14A. Okay, so first question is find the parameter of the following figures given below. Okay, so A. In A, you can see which figure is given. You can see it is rectangle is given. Okay, whose length is given and breadth is given. So, parameter of, uh, to find the parameter of rectangle. Length is 3 cm, breadth is 4 cent, uh, 8 cm given. Okay. Now, formula parameter of rectangle equals to length into 2 into length plus breadth. Okay. So, equals to 2 into 3 plus 8. 2, 3 plus 8, 11. 11, 2 is 2, 11 is 22. 22 centimeters. Okay. So, parameter of rectangle is 22 centimeter. Okay. Now, let's see question number B. In question number B, square is given. Which figure is given? Square is given. And as you can see, all the sides of the square is having equal size. And now, 6 centimeters, 6 centimeters, 6 centimeters. Clear? That's why the formula of finding square is 4 into length of one side because all four sides are equal. Okay? So, length of one side already given is 6 cm. Now, parameter of a square is equal to 4 into length of one side equals to 4 into 6 equals to 24 centimeter. So, parameter of the square is 24 centimeters. I hope this question is clear to all of you. Now, C and D is your homework. It's for your practice. If you find any confusion, ask in the live classes. Clear? Now, let's see question number 2. So question number 2 is find the parameter of a square with the following sides. Just now we have solved this question. Parameter of a square is equal to 4 into length of one side. Okay. In question number 2 also find the parameters of the squares of the following sides. So A, question number A, 8 centimeter. Okay. One side is given, length of one side 8 centimeter. So, parameter of a square is equal to 4 into length of one side. Equals to 4 into 8, which is given equals to 32 centimeters. It is very easy, very simple, but you have to learn the formulas. If formulas you have learned or tips, then one minute, hardly one minute question. Questions are there. Okay. Now question number B. 10 centimeters. So length of one side is 10 centimeter. Again parameter of the square is equal to 4 into length of one side that is 10 given and 4 tens are 40. So parameter of the square is 40 centimeters. Clear to all of you? Now question number C and D is what is your practice. Okay. Now let's see question number 3. Question 3 is find the parameters of rectangle. Now you have to find parameters of rectangle. So children in this question as you can see length 7 cm, breadth 3 cm is already given. Okay. Now we have to find the parameter of Rectangle. So formula 2 length plus breadth. 2 length is given 7 cm. Breadth is given 3 cm. Okay. 7 plus 3 10. 2 into 10 that is 20 cm. Okay. So parameter of rectangle is 20 cm. Now let's see question number B. In question number B 
What's the formula of uh, finding the triangle? This sum of all the sides, है ना? So it's very easy. Seven centimeters given diameter of triangle. Sum of all the sides. Seven plus seven plus seven. Okay? It's not important that uh, it's not important. Uh, it's not necessary. Not important. It's not necessary. That always the same uh, sides, equal sides are there. Okay, here on the top panel, four will can also be there. Six also be there, can also be there. So you simply you have to do the addition of all the sides for finding the diameter of triangle. Okay, whether they are equal or whether they are not equal, it doesn't matter. So seven plus seven plus seven, twenty-one centimeter. Okay. Now question number B. Again, diameter of triangle. One side is given. So nine plus nine plus nine. Three times why we are doing because triangle is having a three sides. So twenty-seven centimeters. Clear to all of you. So children, do this in your notes. And if you find any problem, you can ask in the live classes. Thank you.